Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But now let's get right into ICP update. This right here is the first update of the month of March. I still can't believe that, you know, the month of March is already here. We're approaching Bitcoin happening and, you know, that is coming up fast too. Uh, but, you know, the month of February was a massive, massive month, as you guys know, for Bitcoin as well as the entire market. And, you know, just yesterday, as we closed out the month of February, we did see Bitcoin close its daily candle you know monthly candle above sixty thousand dollars which is also a huge huge plus point but you know for looking at icp though you know we're seeing something not as similar as to what majority of the altcoins are doing right now you know, icp has been lagging behind you know uh, majority of the markets right now and that's gotten a lot of people to questions you know i'm going to share my personal thoughts with you guys on that so sit back relax and enjoy the show so um as we're examining the overall market you know you're seeing uh, some coins that are still in a little bit of a pullback but you know we need to keep in mind um you know the last week was extremely extremely bullish for the entire space so obviously a little bit of a cool off is going to be needed especially after bitcoin is seeing uh, a little bit of a retracement now uh, but you know if you're looking at icp icp hasn't really been outpacing uh you know some of these coins you can pretty much see on the weekly time frame icp is only up 1.7 percent so it's not having its momentum that we're used to seeing so what exactly is next that's what we're going to be talking about so if we're looking at the price of internet computer today as of march the first it's currently sitting at 12 dollars and 78 cents but it's up 1.2 percent over the past 24 hours in a bitcoin comparative now if we're looking at its market cap it's approaching the 5.9 billion dollars with the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 225.7 million dollars but before we go into it any further as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so i'm going to start off with bitcoin dominance you know if you're looking at bitcoin dominance just from february 26 which was literally four days back we did see this massive spike in the bitcoin dominance index and the reason as to why this is the case is because of course bitcoin saw an insane insane rally over the past three days and obviously if you've been watching my icp updates you guys know that you know we were seeing bitcoin consolidating at this previous you know yearly high and this is a huge resistance as i've spoken to you guys about for quite some time we did see bitcoin retesting 39k level um, as well back in uh, january you know we closed the cme gap and then look at since then how far the market has come up but you know this consolidation phase was you know speaking a lot um you know in terms of me um you know this was speaking to me and you can pretty much see this for yourself as soon as we entered the 23.6 fib zone you know bitcoin made its way up to some crazy crazy heights and right now if we're looking at it we're only about 4.5 percent away from its a yearly high so you know things are looking insanely insanely good for btc but you know if we're looking at icp on the other hand icp is not showing us great momentum so what exactly is happening and that might be the question that you have right now so of course you know this upward trajectory that we were forming since a january 20 fourth um you know we were clearly in this upwards trend but you know that has officially been invalidated especially after this massive wick we did see at ten dollars and 87 cents you know this massive wick right here again you know was due to leverage trading as you guys can see um you know massive amounts of uh, you know i think long scott liquidated around this range because of course icp was one of the projects with insane amount of momentum for the entire space that wasn't moving so what i'm personally thinking is a lot of long started piling up and you know, we did see uh, massive amounts of manipulation occurring and you know uh, to shake out all these you know longs that were piling up so you know i think this is the reason as to why we saw this massive wick towards the downside but you can see this for yourself this wick did not last too long you know we've seen the price bouncing back up to twelve dollars 77 cents quite fast but what you're looking at right now is you know the price is having a hard time getting past uh thirteen dollars and sixty four cents reason as to why this is the case is because as of now you know i'm starting to notice you know small interest uh you know in terms of icp as to what we were seeing over the course of the last you know month month and a half reason why that's the case is because you know a lot of coins that did not pop off originally are popping off and you know a lot of investors you know are locking in profits from projects that you know started pumping early and you know icp is one of them um and of course you know we are seeing some profits being taken out you know positions are being switched and you know people tend to do that and that is currently happening but you know this kind of gives me a full-on confirmation i uh, remember that you know massive news that came out from voyager uh you know where they said you know icp etp 
has been announced i think since then you know literally what a coincidence you know as soon as that announcement came out we've seen you know a negative um you know strength in the price of icp that's what i've been sensing and you know since then literally you know we've seen the price of icp making its way down to twelve dollars and eight cents and um you know we haven't really gotten back past this uh, key resistance marks you know we need to keep these factors in mind i think sell the news event is taking place right now uh but you know as far as icp goes um you know the holders still are mega bull and the community has not stopped um, and you know that is something that's worthwhile noting people are mega bullish on ICP for the long haul and there's a lot of developments coming out uh, as I've said to you guys from before as far as this ecosystem is concerned and I still think you know layer ones and layer twos as well as airdrops are the narrative of the bull cycle and the biggest one of course the cherry on top the ETFs which I'm sure you guys can really see the significance of that but you know that's how I'm currently I'm um, you know, analyzing the price of ICP as long as it trades within uh, sideways of above the key support line at eleven dollars eighty one cents you know i think it's totally okay and we will see it start pushing back up uh slowly but surely but you really want to see the price of icp actually holding it back above thirteen dollars sixty four cents you know that's the level where i want to see it but we'll take it one step at a time let me know down below what you guys think love you all see you tomorrow in crypto zx and peace